Please don't leave me alone! Yo, whoa, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Dan, aka Drive. Pretty guys, another episode of our Pokemon Blazing Emerald Hardcore Nuzlocke. If you missed the last one, you can check out the description below. But things went down, man. I stumbled into a very tough trainer, and it kind of threw us for a loop, man. I lost my starter Scorch, and yeah, it's just rough. So we've got a team of five right now. I'm not sure what I'm going to do just yet. Uh, we've got some training to do. I got a lot of stuff that we have to do. We have some good stuff, right? Like, it's not like we don't have a good PC. We have a lot of stuff in our PC, right? So we have options, but the hope is to ultimately get to Victory Road today, or at least through Victory Road. But we're going to explore a little bit. I'm going to get some money. I might do some EV training. I'm not really sure all the things we're going to do, but we'll just have some fun with it. So if you enjoy the series, hit the like button. You know, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and let's just do things. Let's make it happen. Gonna go Citopolis first. I don't think I have Dive right now. Yeah, I gotta get Dive again. I was advised to look in this area. So, I'm gonna get rid of Waterfall for now for Dive. Probably don't need both. So we are gonna need to figure out the level gap issue as well. For those that don't know, there's like a huge level issue that we're gonna run into. The Elite Four is like busted in terms of levels. All right, underwater. Oh, double chin chat, look at that. Oh, that's what it was! There's a Manaphy right there! There's just a Manaphy chilling. Yo, okay, someone told me to dive around Sutopolis, and then I just see a Manaphy. I have, I have dust balls, I have dive balls, I have a master ball, I have net balls, I have timer balls, the best thing ever. Let's get it! I need to not fail this. Sean, thanks for 48. I need to not fail this, because this could be the secret key. Oh my god, he's level 30, bro. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Oh, I didn't know he was going to be level 30. Well, that's a doozy of a time. Uh, well, I have failed. He just charmed me, actually. That's a good thing. If he charms me multiple times and I dive... Then we may be on it. He has water spout, I think. If he charms me. I just caught a full health Manaphy with an Ultra Ball? What? 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 Brosidon King of the Brosian? Bro, we legitimately just caught a Manaphy. He has water absorb? And he does have Water Spout. This thing actually might be the most busted Pokemon of all time. Well, I found my sixth member. This is it. I have a little bit of a, I have two water types, but water types are always good. I have a little bit of a ground weakness. Rolex and Fox are ground weaknesses. I have an immunity with, with Nimbus and I have Stag as a, a resistance. I think I just do it. I think this is the team. So now, now what we do, I need to EV train is what I need to do. I don't want to, but I have to. I don't know how to do this. I see the key item. Press R. I'm pressing the R on my keyboard. Got to set the scanner as my R. There we go. Oh, he's got perfect attack and terrible speed. Oh, really bad special attack. So at least I can see them now. Okay, that's actually clutch. I didn't know that was a thing. All right, where was the ability person? Because we definitely just met the ability person not that long ago. They might have been in Citopolis. Now he has Flash Fire. Okay, so I just gave him Flash Fire as an immunity. That's what I wanted. All right, cool. Everyone else is good with their abilities right now. Okay, so you're gonna be HP, you're gonna be HP. You probably should be max HP, max special attack. I think I'm gonna max everybody in HP. The only concern is like, should I make, is it greatly? Sharply raises speed and special attack. I think I do HP for everybody, honestly. I'm all about the bulk. I think if I do max HP on everybody and then do like defense, attack, special attack, attack, defense, special attack, then we're in a good spot. Oh, he puts me to sleep. What, like, what is that? How are you gonna, how are you gonna put me to sleep right away? Oh my, what is this? 
Second shiny while EV training. Die. Okay, and now we just have to do attack. Oh, he has Pokerus. That's the difference. He has Pokerus. Got it. I can't spread it, but some of the old OGs in the team have it already. That makes sense. I wish I had a choice scarf. I feel like I would just scarf Stag and he would just be like a monster, but he's so slow. So like I kind of have to just use him. Two in, a, in an episode! Shiny hit Montab. Goodbye! Oh, I missed. He doesn't want to die. Now he does. Oh yeah, I can buy hard skills. Okay. So I don't know if I necessarily need it. I definitely want to buy rare candies. I want to make sure I have money. So I think I went and sold like everything good already anyway the other day. The rare candies are the big things. I, I, I'm not going to ever use that. So we need to use our rare candies. So I have 10 rare candies. I think I just kind of evenly distribute them right now. And I'm going to buy some more rare candies. So the level cap is 60. Now, my, I don't think there's any penalty for going over the level cap. Does anyone know? Like, if I go over, are they not going to listen to me? Can you turn off hard mode to train and then turn it? No, I'm not going to do that. Like, the level cap is the level cap. But I am going to go over it just because you kind of have to. I don't want to spend all my money, but I definitely want to rare candy some things. So just to give you guys an idea as to why I'm doing this, I feel like this is a fair compromise because the level cap... Like, the Pokemon that you face in the Elite Four are legitimately up to 75, I think. I think it's level 75. Like, let me go look. Like, I'm not looking at the team, but there's, like, the document says what levels they're at. So the first Elite Four member is 63 to 67, and the champion is 71 to 75. So to me, I feel like I should be in the 60s, like, high 60s. So that's how I'm feeling about the situation. So I will rare candy because I'm limited by the amount of money I have to do this anyway. So it's not like I can just infinitely rare candy. I'm limited by the money I have. So like I can only get nine rare candies anyway. So like I don't even have enough money to get all of them. I'm going to get six for now, which will get me close. And then I'm going to hopefully get some money on the way. So the next detour I'm going to take is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go back into Meteor Falls. Which may be a terrible choice, but I, I feel like I need to. I need Dragon Claw, so we're gonna go back. And that was the play. Like, I'm a little bit better, like, more prepared now. My team's EV train and stuff. All right, so we're gonna go back to the Dragon's Den. And we're gonna hopefully have a better time than I had last time in the Dragon's Den. Okay, so I got the Dragon Claw. There was no other trainers. That was all I was looking to get to. The dive spot in the abandoned ship. Oh, I never did that Yeah, I guess I can go back to the abandoned ship. That's fair. We could do that. Just kind of alternating dive and waterfall right now. Okay, this is the bottom of the abandoned ship. Oh, there are sparkles in the door on the floor. Oh, there's a sparkle up here. Room key one. Oh, I see now. I'm just going like really fast. A dream orb. A dream orb. A mysterious orb that channels energy. Lately, my friends in Rustboro City have been having a similar nightmare involving an abandoned ship. I wonder if the Dream Orb has some connection to Rustboro City. To Rustboro City we go! Oh, it is open now! Oh, fancy cave. There's a small hollow opening in the top of the stone. Place your hand into the hole? I don't know about that. The Dream Orb is shaking violently in my bag. The Dream Orb shattered. Very dark. Oh, I can't get out now. Oh, there's an opening. A dark energy is emanating from within. Would you like to enter? I mean, I guess. Old lady? You poor thing, you must be exhausted. Rest here as long as you'd like. Oh, this is a trap. This is a trap, I don't have a choice. The television is displaying bright colored lines. The computer won't turn on. This is a nightmare! The clock is ticking, but the hands won't move! I found the Hoenn region map! Dad? 
I never should have left him alone, Dad! Please don't leave me alone! Darkrai! It is Darkrai the culprit. I wonder if running through the black, like the darkness is a, a call to a glitch. I don't know if you guys are familiar with this, but, uh, and I actually know this and did it myself because I played through the, the Pokemon Diamond and Pearl games in Japanese before they came out in English. But there was a glitch in Diamond and Pearl where you could actually, in the Elite Four, surf into the Elite Four door. And you could walk through the map, essentially, with all blackness, and you would use the, the counter on the bottom of the screen to count your footsteps. You would use the underground kit, and you'd be able to actually get to Shaman and Darkrai. So I guess I get to fight Darkrai here. I don't know what's gonna happen. Are we just fighting? Oh, we just fight him? I hope he doesn't have a super crazy level. 50, okay, I can work with that. Like, there's no way Blaze Kit kills. Oh, he has, he has Shadow Tags, so this is just, I may have to kill him. If he either knocks me, like, he may knock me out, I may have to Master Ball, like, I, I'm not gonna risk Manaphy for this. I think at this stage I just Master Ball, or... I think I just Master Ball, honestly, at this point. Because I don't know what his ability is, I don't know what his other moves, like, he used some moves I've never seen before, and if they do more damage on, on sleeping Pokemon or something, I'm in a very bad spot. I think, I think just safely going for a Master Ball here is probably my bet. Timer Ball? Bro, if I lose Manaphy, though... I'll do one timer ball, bro. If I lose Manaphy, you're banned. You're lucky I didn't lose Manaphy. I'll YOLO it one more time. I'll YOLO it one more time. Oh, he has Shadow Tag. That's true. He doesn't have bad dreams, but still. Okay, I, I no more risks. We, we Master Ball him. <sighs> Not worth risking it, man. Where are, there are bad dreams in mass, a Dark Rise most certainly the culprit. It feeds off the negative energy of those around it. Now this is a really good Mon to have as a backup. So he's level 50. He has Shadow Tag, Bashful Nature, Blackout, Smothers the Foe with Vile Energy, May Inflict Sleep. 100% accurate sleep move called Shade Trance. He had Dream Eater. Yeah, that's why, that's why I wasn't gonna risk it. I needed to just Master Ball it because he could have easily like started Dream Eater me. This thing actually might be broken, by the way. 100% sleep move. A chance to sleep him with this ghost move. Dream Eater, which can heal. Dark Pulse, this thing is actually kind of busted. We're just gonna play at nighttime. Let's head to Victory Road. I need money is what I need. I don't have an amulet coin, do I? I never got one. I'm talking to your mom? Oh, I don't know. Do you get something talking to your mom? I never, oh, maybe I never went and talked to my mom. Let me go. If she wants to give me some more money, I'm about it. Oh, she just gave me the amulet coin. Look at that. Look at that. That's actually huge, dude. And we have a Pokemon Center, so now I can travel here, which is good. All right, Victory Road. New encounter, by the way. Something I've never seen. Lucario. Let's see what we get. I'll let my repel run out. The level cap would be 60, right? I'm just a little above it. Let's see what our encounter is gonna be. Rhyhorn, the gold bat's a dupe. Ah, is that Walter? Hi, A Drive. I bet you're surprised to see me here. I made it all the way here, and it's all thanks to you. Losing you has only made me stronger, but I'm not gonna lose anymore. I'm gonna win for the Pokemon who gave me courage and strength. Here I come. I mean, get out of here. Goodbye. Lamp is kind of busted in this. There it is. Don't you dare destiny bond me. I'm faster. Goodbye! Let's go, 24K. That's a rare candy right there. There was another waterfall I could've, oh, stay away from double battles, thank you. Water ghost, you're gone. Shadow ball, everything. But yeah, guys, uh, and you're, go you're dead too. Uh, a lot of people are asking about the pre-order link. Using my link for Best Buy in general just helps, so if you're ever getting anything from Best Buy, over the holiday season in the, in the US, just uh, use my link, that's all. What is this? Psychic, ooh, I wanted that actually.
Now, my deal works on, so Nintendo products are the main thing, but it works on everything. I don't want to miss anything here, but at the same time, like, I feel like I'm almost done. All they do is protect against me. He went for fly. Any idea when switches are restocking? Uh, the OLED switches are not restocking. There's like some serious supply shortages right now. I love how you just walk past them. That's scary, but I think I'm okay. Thun Thunderbolt slacking new meta. Can I not get swept by a Calm Mind Gardevoir right now? Can I not? Can I not get swept by this thing? I'm asleep. I'm in trouble, Thunderbolt. I'm in so much trouble right now. Fifty-one. I gotta believe that Nimbus can take a hit and then one shot with play rough. That was unnecessarily difficult. Slacking. It's my own fault for not waking up Fox. I saw that he was sleeping earlier and I just like didn't think anything of it. I was like, oh yeah, he's, he'll be fine. Is this the end? It's the end. Nailed it. Woo, baby, okay. We made it all the way, ladies and gentlemen. We've made it all the way. All right, I need to, we basically need to sell everything that is not gonna be useful for us. I gotta believe, so PP ups are clutch, right? So we're gonna use some of those, but I definitely don't need all of them. That's fine. Dark bargain is a status move. So like, I wouldn't use that more than once in a battle, probably maybe twice, so that's not an issue. Okay, everything else is fine. We don't really, we don't really need those. For now, let's grab a hard scale. Shop's closed for the night, what is that? You're standing here. Well, luckily I can teleport time, Trent, whatever it's called. Yeah, I know, when did Pokemon Marts have store hours? Like, what is this? None of these moves are like significant. Uh, Ancient Power has some, some, some viability here, right? But like, I'm not convinced that any of those are all that good for Rolex. Like Rolex, Freeze Dry is super good, Earth Power is super good, Crystal is super good. Waterfall, not so much, right? Like, that's not really doing it for me. Okay, so now I would have liked to have a little bit more money. Let's see how close we are, like where our levels are gonna be, how many rare candies I can buy. There's more trainers west of Pacific Log Town. So I can get eight rare candies. So eight rare candies puts <laughs> puts my team one level higher. Like it doesn't even make a dent. That's, that's not gonna move the needle for us really. Oh, there's a rare candy, whoa, that moves the needle though. We take those. I would really like another like, two or three rare candies like per pokemon <laughs> we may have to solve this rare candy issue on the next episode uh like i said i i, I don't want to turn off the uh i don't want to turn off the the level cap because we've been playing with it this whole time i've been using rare candies to go above it because you know like i said the, the champion has i don't know what his team is but he has up to level 75. so to me i'd like to be realistically you know, just a few more levels. I'd like to be 67-ish for everybody to have a chance in my mind, because otherwise I don't think you have a chance. I, I just personally, I don't think you have a chance, but either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Blazing Emerald. Some crazy stuff went down. Make sure you guys like the video and subscribe if you guys are new and stay tuned for the Elite Four, my friends. That is the end of the episode. I'm done. That's it, the episode's over, bye.